I go here with uh, Wellens, Theo Fairweather Johnson after a disappointing 2-0 defeat at Western Supermare. As I said to Jamie, that's a third away defeat on the spin now. How are we going to halt this run? Sticking together. Uh, obviously the boys are a bit disappointed losing 2-0 away. Obviously, like you said, it's our third away defeat on the spin. But for the togetherness and uh, the belief in our team, we'll uh, stop the run and hopefully on our next away travel we'll pick up three points. Yeah, I said to, said to Jamie as well, and I say it to you, I think teams like Western, we would beat at home. But coming here, it's a different scenario. What do you put that down to? Could be anything. Could be uh, mental toughness, long travelling. But I think we should be coming here and beating teams like Western. Obviously, they say at home. We've been unbeaten this season in the league at home. But I just think, stick, by sticking together, like we've got Bath, Chua, then we're A games. Stick together, I think we should... Uh, Points and, uh, we'll be right. Yeah, the, the first half, I think we started well. I think we, you know, we had a lot of the ball, um, but then the penalty decision, which I don't think was a penalty. Your, your oh, thoughts uh, first of all? We couldn't see it. Doug gets a really deep, but yeah. Right, Gavin Gaffer's always says, stay on your feet, don't dive in, don't give the ref nothing to, to penalise you about. But obviously he's put it wide, and I think then we should have pointed the game to him a little bit. But I think we might have a bit too, too much respect to South them and. Uh, Obviously they've gone and nicked a goal before half time. Yeah, it was a poor goal to give away. I, I, sometimes you feel that's not a sort of goal we would give away at home. No, uh, definitely not. But obviously, reactions. We've got to pick up seconds. It's dropped in our six yard box. We've got, we ain't cleared it. We've been punished. So we'll look at positives. Second half, I thought we were much better. We had a lot of chances. A lot of chances. Uh, just want one of them to fall in. Just one. No, that's right. Breakaway goal, give it away in the midfield. Uh, you know, there's not much you can put that down to, really. Chasing the game, mm. just uh, the number of things chasing the game, all pushing forward. But it's just one of them things at the end of the day. What did the management say to you after the game? Obviously, we've got 13 games left. Gaffer, Jamie basically said uh, that we've got 13 cup finals, we stick together. We all want the same thing promotion in the day. So every team will be up to beat us because. We're a non-team, we play good football, but 13 games, 13 cup finals and hopefully in an event the result will go our way. Yeah, let's hope so. Looking at um, looking at your career at Welling to, today, it's the first time that we've we, we've done an interview. Um, how do you feel it's gone so far? I've come from obviously league two league, leagues below. So obviously uh, coming up to this, this level, it's different, different to the Ryman, obviously, harder, but obviously like trying to fit in and uh, get the balance right and my performance consistently. It's been a bit up and down, as probably people have noticed, but just trying to stick in there and uh, help the team as much as I can and perform well. You're growing with confidence though, and yeah. I think that's fair to say. Ah, look, uh, James put belief in me. I've got belief in him, as for us, the management, everyone, the players. So I'm learning I'm learning all the time off that senior players, Clark, you, Joe, you know, so hopefully they get me through and I uh, can improve my game all round. Yep, Saturday back at home, got made and Ed needs to put that right. Uh, look, we own one. I think uh, every team we've lost to, we've gained revenge, I believe. So uh, hopefully, go home, get out right home, get the fans behind us, get the boys back playing, how we get three points and uh, keep this promotion push on track. Thanks for your time, Theo. Well done. Thanks, mate.